I'm Tom Beckstrand, and this is the Kimber KHX OR. Now, the OR stands for Optics Ready, and as you can tell by looking at this pistol, it's equipped with a mini red dot sight uh, as it ships from the factory. Now, this particular red dot sight is the Type 2 Trigicon RMR that's got a 3.25 MOA dot. What's that mean? Well, it's a small dot. So if you want precision, you just dial down the illumination and you can hit precise targets. You want a ding steel at 100 yards, you can with this pistol. It's got a great trigger, nine millimeters, nice and flat, but above all else, the mini red dot side allows you to do that. If you want to run a plate rack very rapidly, you just turn that dot up so it gets big and bright. It's easy to find and you can run from one plate to the next or from one target to the next. Uh, it's got suppressor ready sights, which is a nice touch, right? A little bit of sighting redundancy never hurt anybody. Uh, you can see, you can actually use the, uh, the sights through the window of the red dot, which is a nice feature. If the unthinkable happens and the red dot dies, you still got your irons ready to go. Um, I, personal opinion, I think any pistol this size should come equipped with a Picatinny rail up on the dust cover. This one does. What that allows you to do is mount a light. And, uh, you know, the reality is um, most of the times when people, when pistols are used defensively, it's, uh, it's at night. That's when the goblins come out. That's when the bad guys want to play. And uh, so being able to put a light on your pistol is a big deal with a full size gun or a duty size gun. Um, it'd be kind of a shame not to. Uh, however, this pistol is available both with and without the Picatinny rail on the uh, dust cover. As you can see, this one is also equipped, also been set up with a personal Surefire light. Uh, what also stands out on the pistol are the hexagonal shapes, right? We got them on the slide, front and rear, replaced cocking serrations. Um, you know, it's a different shape. It's nice to look at. Uh, but the real magic happens when we get down here to the front strap, right? When we get to the front strap, it's not on Kelman on a 1911 for those to be cut about 30 lines per inch. And what'll happen is if you've got a ring on your firing hand, when you grab the pistol under recoil, that ring can sometimes flatten out that checkering, right? So if you look really closely at this one, what you'll see is our little tiny hexagons, it's called stiplex, milled into the front strap and it's supported on all sides. So instead of a texture that comes to a fine point that can be damaged, these are more like little ridge lines that kind of run all over the place. Uh, great texture, but also very durable. The uh, Last thing I really like that's unique about the KHX is the uh, the grips. They're G10, which is super durable. Uh, it's a laminate and epoxy, very hard to damage. But on this one, they uh, they come down and they form a bit of a magwell. So when you're out at the range, it's always nice to be able to work on your reloads and try to get those times down. And uh, this pistol ships uh, with uh, with a magwell that allows you to do that. So uh, this is the Kimber KHX OR. It means optics ready. For more, go to www.kimberamerica.com.